Hey YouTube, Gold Hunter here. In today's video, we're going to show you how to turn cigarettes into pure gold just by making a simple little tweak. So, in this video, we're going to keep it with the US. Okay, now you Canadians, don't get your uh, panties in a bunch. We are going to do a whole video just for you guys because I know that cigarettes are quite a bit more expensive in Canada and it's going to skew these numbers quite a bit. So we're just going to keep uh, this video for US only. Now, definitely if you're from Canada, definitely watch it. It's definitely uh, eye-opening in its own. So Mar Marlboro cigarettes tend to be the most expensive at around $9 per pack in many states. Now, I understand you might think, okay, my state Newports are more expensive or whatever. I understand that it's an average, okay? Average Marlboro cigarettes tend to be more. So this equals out to 45 cents each. And again, I know you're gonna say, my state, they're more than $9 per pack or my state, they're less than $9 per pack. I understand that, I agree. We're just going with average, okay? So each cigarette is 45 cents each in this uh, average. According to the American Lung Association, the average daily smoker smokes 15 cigarettes per day. And I know you're gonna say, I smoke way more than that. Well, then you can save even more and you can even earn even more gold. Okay, so say if we go with 15 per day, like the American Lung Association says, that is $6.75 per day cost you. Per week, it's $47.25. These are US numbers. That's 105 cigarettes. Now, if you go per month, I'm doing a 30 day month. I know some months have 31, but we're gonna go 30 because really our only number we're really going to really worry about is the year anyways. But I just wanted to throw the month in here. So per month you're spending $202.50. And for a year, at 15 cigarettes per day, you're spending $2,463.75. That is a total of 5,475 cigarettes you're smoking. Now, if you were to just quit and go down to zero per day, you could save $2,463.75 per year. But I'm not suggesting that. You know, if you can, that's great. It would be a lot healthier for you. But I don't suggest anyone do something they can't. Uh, if you can, that's great. If you can't, okay. What I'm suggesting, what you probably can do is maybe just cut back a little bit, right? We're not even cutting in half. We're cutting by a third. So if you can get down to 10 per day, that is 450 per day, okay? That's 10 cigarettes, $4.50 per day. Per week, you're down to 3150 Per month, you're down to $135 per month. And yearly, you're down to $1,642.50 per year. So, I think you've almost cut 2,000 cigarettes out by this, doing this way. And this gets you a total of $821.25 US per year of savings. Okay, now you're going to ask, how does that equate to pure gold? Well, right now at time of video, one ounce of pure gold is $2,320.37. That's a troy ounce. Okay, so if we cut our five cigarettes per day for one year, that's a savings of $821.25. One gram of gold 
at time of video is $74.61. Okay. So if we take our five cigarettes per day and we get rid of them, and that will equal, or we can buy 11 grams of gold for $820.71. And that actually gets us just a little bit under what we saved for the year. So, yeah, that's how you get your pure gold, right? I'm not telling you to, to quit smoking. But hey, if you can, again, that's great. But if you just cut back by a third, you can buy 11 grams of gold with that savings. Okay? Now, if you were to smoke more than 15 per day and you cut back by a third, you can probably, you know, maybe you can get 15 grams of gold, right? And if you remember what the price was or how much it was for uh, 15 cigarettes per day for the whole year, if you were to quit smoking totally, you could actually get a full troy ounce of gold. Okay, per year. So that's how we do it. That's how we change cigarettes into pure gold. Should I make videos on other items to show how much gold you can acquire if you change a habit for a year? What other items would you like to see? If you've made it this far in the video, I would love it if you can comment. So on anything, like comment on what you would like to see, comment on what you think of this video, what you think of past videos, what you um, would like more of, what you didn't like, right? It doesn't have to be what you like. It could be what you didn't like what you think I should do different, okay? But if you could tell me something that you would like to see, that's that's perfect, okay? So I would like you to please like and subscribe. It really helps the channel out a lot, and it's free. It doesn't cost anything, right? All right. Gold Hunter out. See you on the next one. Stay golden, YouTube.